Hi Sagittarius! I had to say that right away. Because <laughs> when it's a good read, stop with the suspense, I'll give it to me. Ace of Cups with a Ten of Pentacles, Money and Love. Empress, you look good. It is going to be your um, Insidereal, of course, but right now in Western it's your happy birthday in your Western, but I do Sidereal. But things right now are a little bit complicated, so five of ones, there are obstacles. And I'm a master of removing any kind of obstacles. I have survived the plague, okay? Not the one the plague in a hundred years ago, okay? The plague of being with someone who is an opposition. Welcome to my channel. My name is Sal. I am an expert of nothing, master of no one. <laughs> I read here every day with giggles and fun, of course, together with your career finances and your relationship. The sass is free. I'll be teaching today how to manifest. How about we teach, do you want to learn how to manifest five of ones and then to get 10 of pentacles to get the love of your life here? Mm-hmm. It starts from within, right? So let's discuss with the five of ones. The card here shows every time you do something, things doesn't go the way it's supposed to, at least for what you think and what you see. But, of course, in reality, everything happened for a reason, and we know that. And you'll be thankful later on that you have to go through the struggles. Yes. Okay. Let me explain. Okay. So that you guys can, we can both relate here. I, my, I myself, okay, has been to one of the most complicated parts of my life was being diagnosed with multidrug-resistant tuberculosis. No cure. You have to find a cure, of course. Of course, it's deadly. It's, you know, 1 in 10 million when you get that. That was complicated time of my life. I could consider this as my five of ones. Everything that I work hard for is now, one, it's gonna be taken away and everything is gonna be an opposite of me because I'm trying to survive life, right? Because you're dying, you know? The doctor says like, oh, you got two weeks, you're coughing blood, you're gonna drown in yourself, blah, 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 blah. And then, you know, we need to confine you in this. So that's a five of ones for me. So, this right here, you'll be thankful later on. I'm not saying that you're sick or you're going to die, but I'm saying it's like there are struggles and the struggle makes either you, whoever you are, an empress or an emperor. You don't become a king or a queen just because you're born into it. Well, of course, some people are. What I'm just saying is like the modern times right now, the struggle makes you this. Appreciate life, attracts a lot of things, you know, that is good for you. Because the empress is showing here luxury, comfort. This is Venus, of course. This is being comfortable in one, you know, where you're at. So if I were to apply this to me, Am I in the Empress Emperor mode? Well, for sure, dang, yeah, you know? I'm here now in a lovely, you know, if I look back, you know, those, those thousands of years surviving the plague, well, you know, I wouldn't be happy. But right now, well, we're in the Empress mode. You got it, okay. So now you kind of see things through, right? But what is important is not for you never to give up on yourself. So you don't give up on yourself, you get to the Empress. Ten of Pentacles here, so someone probably here needed a pep talk. I got you, I got you. Ten of Pentacles is manifestation of your career, your finances, right? So if there's anything I know, is how to get here. Consistency is the key first. Without blood, sweat, and tears, it's hard to get to a Ten of Pentacles, not unless you are definitely blessed in your chart. I've seen people who barely work, sweat, but they still get a Ten of Pentacles. So you know you, basically, like, yeah, so that's not me. Then you're in the consistency part. I'm in the consistency part. I'm in the I work hard part. I'm not one of those people who's blessed with their chart that they get the, you know, they get different karma this lifetime, that they get the Ten of Pentacles right away. You understand me? So you work hard to get this, this relationship, this property, this real estate. We like. And also, the love that you've been waiting for. We love a good love cell. Scorpio can be here. We don't like Scorpio cell. I'm kidding. <laughs> That's your neighbor. Okay, it's actually still Scorpio season, just letting you know. Don't get confused. I do West as I do. So someone reaches out to you, okay? Someone wants you, someone desires you. Okay. Now, but I feel like this is more of like in the middle of December 15, moving forward to January, okay? Because the recognition when the sun officially moves to Sagittarius is around December 16. When I say official, you can look at the chart, the sun right now, it is in Scorpio. I'm not trying to confuse anyone. Eight of Pentacles here with the Six of Swords. Um, <laughs> regret, consistency. I tried to do everything that is best for me, but nothing still comes out, you know. 
So you're becoming more Nine of Swords with the Eight of Pentacles. You're very impatient right now. The number one thing that people are looking for in their entire life is their soulmate. The remedy that I give them, wear a red thread bracelet. Can I name drop? Rihanna's been wearing this one for a very long time. In just the first hour, hundreds of order with a red thread bracelet. If I was you and you're looking for a soulmate, visit our website, eatreadlove.me. Order one today. Nine of Pentacles, uh, Eight of Pentacles, sorry, and eight, Nine of Swords, you're impatient. You can't wait for your struggle to be over. Where I'm at now is still a struggle. The struggle that I have dying is a struggle. The struggle I have right now, I'm still struggling because it's a different phase in my life. So the struggle will never be over. Rich or poor, healthy or not healthy, we all will have struggle. We're humans, we're bound by this body. So Nine of Swords here with the Eight of Pentacles, I'm seeing here where you just want it over. All these things that you have tried, which is relationship-wise, you're letting it go. So it could be, you know, expressing your solar return right now. What you are manifesting, well, 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 magician, I got the perfect tea for you. Our Zodiac bracelet right now comes in gold vermeil, okay, in real gold. You can check it out and you can get it for free. I mean, this is the Zodiac bracelet. You can get a free Eternity Red Thread Real Gold bracelet. Okay, this is free. And I'm wearing mine already. So the goal here is for us to manifest all together. Because lucky color for 2024 is red. And at the same time, it is the year of the dragon, the wood dragon. So I'll talk more about it. But wear it on your right wrist. If you're single, of course, couple on the left. It comes in a couple also. You can order the couple one if you're in a happy, committed relationship. Okay? To strengthen the bond. Of the connection, the relationship exchange, with you know the you know the wearing of the bracelet. So we ship to more than eighty countries across the globe, and of course, I believe our holiday collection is free shipping in the U.S. up to fifty percent off. You're manifesting good things in your life, which I'm seeing here. Magician Knight of Wands, you may be traveling. You get a lot of offer from people. A lot of people are interested in what you do. How do you do it? And how did you make it happen? You make it look easy, but it's not. Of course, a lot of people look at it where, oh, you got a good life. People probably look at me, if I'm just connecting with you, that I got a good life. Do I have a good life? I have one of the most amazing life because I'm still alive. Is it good? I feel like it's challenging. Amazing, yes, challenging <laughs> every day. Uh, Magician with the Knight of Wands over here, it's giving, you know, like you want to have fun, you want to relax. You've been thinking about Four of Swords with the Nine of Pentacles, where you're at. So a lot of like uh, nostalgia-wise of like, man, that was 2023. Man, that was that year. That was that year. So you're looking at your past. So you're, you're, it's good because then it keeps you actually grounded. Okay, we love. You got the Page of Pentacles here and the Three of Page of Wands and the Three of Pentacles. What I'm seeing for you, hear me out. Ooh, okay. The light at the end of the tunnel, which is a sun card. You might be trying to become famous, the sun and the uh, the sun and the strength card. So I'm not sure if you're an artist who wants to go to the stage, the sun. Remember, the sun, okay, gemstone is ruby. Okay. Oh, oh, and mold, uh, if you want to break through a certain cycle, our ring small divide is available. Now I have here. Look. Okay. So when I was working for my success and fame, of course, I you know I don't know if I'm famous, but success, I was working on it. Um, I do have ruby. Ideally, you can wear it as a pendant also. But of course, I have my my, um, my shield of uh, David here. So, but here, ruby can be used. Okay, we have ruby collection if you're trying to become um, famous. So, alignment through the sun. The sun is recognized. Now, you can also work with pearl. But other people um, in their culture, in their religion, they're not um, you know open to it. Meaning, it's not uh, it's not allowed. So, but ruby. Okay. Um, this is, uh, I believe it's called Pigeon's Blood. So uh, I forgot where it came from, but it's Pigeon's Blood, which is the highest kind of ruby. But we have ruby in our website. I'm just letting you know. Because strength with the sun card style, I'm trying, and I'm trying my best. Girl, get that ruby. <laughs> so, Queen of Wands, success, of course. But your success comes with certain limitation. I feel like... You will have to learn to say no to certain things. I feel like this whole, you're going to close strong, uh, strong 2023, and you're going to push through 2024 like nothing. Okay? So this is good. And I feel like the person who wants to be with you, still wants to be with you, King of Wands, it is now going to be up to you. Queen of Wands, Seven of Wands, and the King of Wands. This is totally up to you. 
should you take it? You'd lower your guard down, you know, kind of accept like, oh yeah, you know, we're kind of seeing each other, but this is more about, you know, like relationship and long-term partnership. You find the one, I feel. Mm, love it. So tomorrow, let's touch the subject again. I will see you. Don't forget, visit our website, eatreadlove.me.